Good morning guys and welcome to 4 minutes at 4 am with Kuldeep Iregudu. So today we are discussing the topic called as the power of mindfulness, cultivating the present and the clarity for your personal growth. Not only personal growth, even your professional, even whatever the relationship, whatever you do, whatever you act or whatever you take up, you should have that mindfulness. So that is a power of or how you can build that power of mindfulness. One of the most important aspect in today's era because everyone are getting distracted because of the social social media because of the mobile phone because of the ease of access to the technology now it doesn't mean that you should not practice the power of mindfulness or rather mindfulness because it has become one of the need of the hour each and every hour whatever if you are working on some project you need to be mindful enough so that you will achieve 10 hours of work in just one hours of time okay if you are having your dinner breakfast lunch whatever if you are feeding or if you are uh, having your breakfast be mindful enough to understand what exactly you are eating. That way, the more assimilation, the digestion process happens very quickly and the more of the nutrients gets inside or imbibed into your body. That is the importance of setting the power of mindfulness. Now, just to elaborate this, I have got three concepts. Let me just decode one by one, right? The concept number one is embracing mindfulness allows individuals to be fully present and engaged in the current moment absolutely see whenever you embrace this mindfulness or whatever the activity when you are doing that activity and when you embrace that mindfulness it will allow you to be fully present fully immersed and fully involved in this particular aspect whatever maybe it is a work maybe if you are having a food if you are having a conversation or if you are listening to an audience or some i'm sorry to a speaker or something like that you will when you engage in that moment you will know or you will have a better grasping ability that is what it calls for the mindfulness with that the second aspect is practicing mindfulness can lead to increased self-awareness and emotional regulation see this is one of the most most important aspect to be understood now what happens when you practice this mindfulness automatically it will lead to increase in the self-awareness you know what you are doing even if you are multitasking it will help you Right. So in one side, you are working on some aspect. On the other side, you are also discussing something that is going to help you because you know what you are self aware of. You know how to control your emotions. You know everything that is what it gives you when you are mindful enough in doing or when you practice the mindfulness aspect. Right. So uh, most important points to be noted. So practicing mindfulness can lead to an increasing self awareness. Please mind this with that. The third aspect is Developing a mindful practice can support mental well-being and contribute to overall personal growth. Too much. Absolute, absolutely correct. Now, see, whenever you practice this, whenever you develop this mindfulness, automatically your personality will grow. Not only in personal level, even at professional level, even at relationship level, even at whatever the activity you are doing. Be mindful enough. Try this for just seven days and automatically you will find the drastic change. Now, if you practice this for next 21 days, then you see how much more improvement you will find in your own self. That is what it takes when you practice or when the power of mindfulness pits in your life. Hope this was useful. This is Kuldeep Iregodo signing off until we meet again in the next day morning. Thank you. Have a great time. Bye-bye.